Hey everybody, guess what? I'm wearing a PlayStation hat. Look at that. Now, you might want to know why I'm making this video. Well, this is an unboxing video, but it's not like any ordinary unboxing video. Because I scored something huge. And it's behind me, sitting on the floor. Now, how I'm going to hook this up, I have no freaking clue. Because it's freaking huge. Anyway, it's right in this big box. Yes, you see it with your own eyes. The PlayStation 5. Your body has now... Oh, yeah, you're going to pay, uh, pay no attention to the camera. I have to get my other lighting up and everything so I can see it better. But that's basically the PS freaking 5. Look how big this is. And it's like... Not working too well. Oh my god, there's tape here. We're going to just cut it off and open it. Right now, we're going to open it. I'm going to be nice to the box, because I kind of want to keep it. But I want to unbox it and take keep the box. Because I don't want to ditch the box. And I found out something. Oh, it's an 825 gig, apparently. That's what this one is. But we'll, we'll get more memory as we go. But right now, we're going to leave it at that. And this is an 8K, 4K, 120 HDR system. I had no clue about that. Way like never before. Now, is this like... Okay, so the, the box box part is inside. Okay, here we go. I'm trying to be nice to the box. I don't want to keep it, but... Come on. Come on. Why are you having hiccups? Why are you having hiccups? Huh? Why are you having hiccups? Why are you have? Oh my god. Shoot. It's freaking insane. Pay no attention to the little guy, like, struggling to open it. It's like it's stuck somewhere. Oh. Probably tape. Or something. That little tape is stronger. Okay. Well... Or is it like one of those tricky boxes? Can't open it all the way. Come on. Why is it stuck on? Come on. Okay. Come on. Come on. Like a glove. Let's go. Oh my God. It's like... Okay, we're gonna work it off. Okay, that. Uh, oh my gosh. This is still a big box. Oh my gosh. I wish. Okay. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Y'all can see this as life. And we're just opening the box. That's all we're doing. And there's another box. There's a. It, it's like boxes and boxes. Okay, so. This is the first part of the box. Oh my gosh. Alright, put this over there. Okay, this first box. So, what's in this first box? Oh my gosh, the controller. I have never thought in my lifetime I would be holding my legit PS5 controller. Oh my gosh. Oh, and it works. Look, it's, it's trying to turn on. I don't know if you can see it, but... Turn on. That is so cool. I actually do like the feel of that. Now, they said the mic is built in onto the controller down there, so I'm hoping that that uh, I could still talk to people, but using this, I hope so. That is solid construction. Wow. A little bit better than the PS4, but I still love my PS4. Don't get me wrong. Power cord. Obviously, power the system. Instruction manuals. So you too can be smart in the ways of that. This is the charge cord for the controller. And it's still use USB-A, but it's USB-C on the other side this time. Uh, USB-C is great, don't get me wrong. For speed, that's about it. Um, this is the stand, so if you want to stand it up, 
chances are I normally like to set mine down, but uh, we'll see about it. And then HDMI cord. This HDMI cord's a little bit different, so we're going to have to figure out how to hook it up and everything. I don't know exactly what we're going to do, but as far as how we're going to get it integrated into my setup here, because my setup is kind of full. So, anyway. Never thought I would have get this system in a million years. Yeah. So we're just going to... Oh my gosh. It's right here. It's literally right here. We're going to grab it like this and just make it out. Okay. Oh wow. Dude, it's just... It is so freaking amazing. And then in the future, I want to get rid of the white and maybe get a red thing, but... I've seen... Okay, so it does rig is like kind of thought. It is kind of big. It will actually fit where I want it to go. Holy crap, but look that behemoth, man. Now, they did say that they they say to buy a thing to put it down. But look, look at that beast of a machine and look at the tiny little buttons. Tiny little buttons. But anyway, wow, I never thought I would own this, to be, to be fair. Well, ever since it came out and it, scalpers were scalping it, I never thought I would own it. Um, also, I'm thinking on doing what I do on my PS4, since now I see two slots here on the back. I'm going to probably get an uh, external 5TB uh, and just plug it in here, and then there you go. I wanted to do internal, but then I was like, more I'm thinking about it. I guess it doesn't matter as long as I plug it back here and I'm good. Because um, it has two USB 3s and then uh, a port so you can play internet connected. And then HDMI, of course, and a power cord. So we're probably going to connect this and see it work. And um, that'll be for the future videos. So what do y'all think about the PS5? I'm sorry for the camera. It's just not working in this light. We need a new light. We need a new PS5 light. All right, anyway, I appreciate you guys watching this video. It's a short video. Anyway, thank you for watching me struggle with the box. I really appreciate it. I did get the, the physical edition because I don't really care for all digital. I do like physical. So I finally got this. So now I'm part of the PS5 clan, but I will not get rid of my PS4 just yet because I actually do love it. Um, I'm going to find a way to keep the PS4 and keep the PS5 as well. Um, I'm going to see if I can just probably integrate my PS4 up where the system selector is and then put the PS5 right below where the PS4 is. I think that would be better. And then kind of cl clean out in there and get rid of all the junk. I think the system will fit right there really well. And then eventually I'll get the 5 terabyte hard drive and we'll put it in here and then have extra space. Anyway, what do y'all think about the PS5? Or do y'all like the Xbox Series X better? Or do you like... What, what do you like best? Anyway, that's my PS5 unboxing and that's all I got. So, thank you. I can't. I can't. Oh my gosh. I love it, man.